Hi, MHD fam. Today I'm here with. I'm Jean Rue. Colleen Howard. And. Dee Dee Long. Rashid. Elijah. Balakov. And. Natalia. So true. And today's question is How important is it for you to prioritize your mental health and why? Prioritizing my mental health is uh, very important because it keeps me grounded with uh, when I'm around my family and my studies and things of that nature and keeps me uh, on a straight path. It's extremely important. Um, I really never gave it, I didn't give it as much weight as I do now and um, it's, I'm happier than I've been because I do prioritize it and I've realized self-care is crucial but it's not getting a manicure for me. It's like taking some time to have some peace and go for a run or that's my self-care and mental health. That's how I help, help my own. Um, I think it's very important so you know you don't go through uh, burnout and all those other uh, complications that come with that. Also like just being self-aware and knowing where you are mentally so you can always be aware of how close you are to that burnout. So I think it's on a scale to like one to 10, like a solid 10. Um, it's very important to prioritize mental health because you know you can't live without a good mental health. And you got to uh, stay above the water always and keep your head up. Um, I'm really glad you guys are bringing attention to this. My grandmother used to tell me you can't pour from an empty cup. Um, and I think that was the old days way of saying to put yourself in a place so you can take care of yourself. Um, and I love that we're making it more acceptable to speak up and say I'm not all right and ask for help from other people. Um, there's such compassion behind it and, and I'm just really glad for that. So for me, it's really important to be a role model to my daughter who's 13 um, and let her know that we're all here for each other and, and we can help each other through the darkness um, because like one of the stickers you guys have, there's no, there's no starlight, there's no light without the darkness, right? So it's really important. I think it's very important uh, and why is it important? I think without prioritizing your mental health, it's easy to put it on the back burner and kind of forget about it. And uh, it's one of those things when once the check engine light comes on for it, it might be too late or a, a bigger hole to dig yourself out of if you don't prioritize it. That's very true. And what things do you do to prioritize your mental health? Uh, the gym, basketball, spending time with friends, not just hanging out, but having some real conversations about what's going on and everything like that, and then time with the babies. Uh, spend time with my family, friends, uh, make music, listen to music, anything that can keep my uh, stress level low. Deep pack, you know, talk to someone about like, if I got an issue uh, I'm dealing with, or uh, go to the gym, exercise, just take my mind off things, go for a walk, that helped too. And then, oh, and I make clothes, so making clothes help me de-stress, so that's about it. Anything. Make clothes, hang out with my friends, have a good time. MHD TV here. We're switching it up here. We got questions for the host herself. What's your name? Amaya Morris. All right, Amaya Morris. What do you do to prioritize your mental health? I like getting active, moving my body, so going for walks, going to the gym, um, doing something creative, something that's just like a hobby for me, kind of to clear my mind, maybe taking time to myself, or if I feel like I need time with my family or friends, I do that too. It's just about feeling what my body really needs and, you know, taking that into account. You heard it here, folks. Tune in. 2024. Something special. <laughs> no, see, you should be the host. Look at that.